Dr. Maximilian Zard at the Health Issue Chiropractic Center. And today we're going to discuss a few ways to use an exercise band to strengthen and stabilize the mid back. A lot of the patients that I have come in uh, with that kind of rounded shoulder appearance, so they look somewhat like this. And so these exercises are wonderful because they're intended to pull the shoulders back so that the chest is out in front of the shoulder itself, so we have that nice, healthy posture. A lot of times patients say that keeping good posture is uncomfortable, and truly, a lot of times that's because you're either misaligned or your muscles aren't conditioned to hold you in the good posture. So these exercises attack one of those two aspects. So if you don't have an exercise band at home, believe it or not, you can actually do these isometrically using a towel, and I'll explain that as we go through the exercises. So the first exercise is called a band pull apart. So you're just gonna grab a lighter resistance band on either end, and we're just gonna open it up just like this just to where the hands are about parallel with the body. Now what you do not have to do is you don't have to completely throw it back there. Sometimes that can be painful and I don't want home exercise to ever be uncomfortable. So again, we're just going back to neutral and then we're just opening it up like so. Okay? You should be able to do about 10 to 20 of these. Okay? And you will certainly start to feel them in your mid back, right between the shoulder blades typically. There's muscles back there called your rhomboid muscles, and those are the ones that we're specifically targeting when we do this exercise. And you can imagine, at the end of this exercise, your chest is forward and your shoulders are back, exactly where we want it to be. Now if you were going to do this exercise with a towel, instead of actually opening it up, you would just hold the towel in front of you at either end, and then you would just pull on the towel. Now the towel is not going to necessarily pull apart unless you're very strong, but what will end up happening is you'll create an isometric hold where you're still squeezing those muscles in between the shoulder blades to create that tension. So even though you won't finish here, you're still strengthening those rhomboid muscles by pulling on that towel. Okay, so that's one exercise again called a band pull apart. The other one is essentially a lat pull down. So if you've ever been in a gym setting where you use a lat pull down pulley system, it kind of imitates that. So this one is intended to drop the shoulders down. A lot of times our shoulders end up drifting a little high on us like so, and this exercise will help to drop those shoulders. So you're gonna hold this same band above your head, and you're just gonna draw it down over your shoulders like so. And then you're gonna come back to neutral, and then you're gonna draw it over the shoulders. Now, I've seen patients sometimes where this gets a little wild, and maybe the band kind of rolls down the back a little bit like so. That's okay, just kind of allow it to sit comfortably across your shoulders like so. So you can see from a side view right where that band should be sitting so that it's not rolling high up on your neck or low down on your back. Instead, rather just kind of sits right in between, okay? Now, in order to do that, you're engaging these muscles here to drop that shoulder down. So, what done with a towel, same idea. You're just gonna pull here, but nothing necessarily is gonna happen as far as the movement goes, but you're gonna be able to engage those lats to pull that down, okay? Now, the last exercise is called a row. Usually, what we'll do with a row is, we'll actually find a way to loop this band around something, maybe something stationary, or what we can always do is we can tie a knot and then shut that end in a door. And essentially what you're doing when you row is, you're gonna grab either end of the band here and you're gonna pull it towards yourself. So again, assuming that this portion here is outwards fastened to either a door or a stationary object, as we pull here, we're again gonna create that chest forward, shoulders back appearance that we're looking for. I usually tell patients you wanna stand kinda of like Wonder Woman or Superman and less like the Incredible Hulk. So these exercises help to do that. Thank you for joining us today to discuss some band exercises. Please don't hesitate to call our office or shoot us an email if you have any questions about how to perform banded exercises for the mid-back.